Welcome! In this video, we're going to talk about our low drone string on our Madeline Hurdy Gurdy. The low drone string inside the instrument, we're going to open the lid so we can see what's going on in there. It's the silver string. As we hold the instrument, it's closest to our lap or closest to the low hanging buttons off the side. For demonstration purposes, I have the instrument laying on a flat table so I can get the best camera angle, although you will likely be holding your instrument upright at the proper angle for playing. When you crank the wheel, the, crank the handle and see the wheel going, likely it's not making any sound. When we ship the instruments, we turn off all the strings for shipping. This string is held in place by a little brass pin over here. We're going to turn it on. The way you do that, I'll pull the string out of the way entirely. You see the pin has two grooves in it. One is an off position, which holds it, which holds it off the wheel. The other is an on position. Not making hardly any sound or great sound. We loosen the strings for shipping, so this is extremely flat. One note also, the cotton here is kind of jimmied off to the side. We want the cotton to go across the wheel rim, so I'm just going to pull the string out and slide it back into position. Yours may or may not be that way. I mention it because who knows what can happen when it's being shipped around the country or the world. So make sure your cotton's in good position. Now we're getting a note. We need to tune it. I've got my electronic tuner here. This string is tuned normally to a C note if you're in the GC tuning, which is our most common one that we ship in. If you are not sure, the tuning charts for these instruments are on page 10 and page 12 of your instruction book, depending on which tuning you are set up in. Page 10 for GC, page 12 for DG tuning. Uh, again, I mentioned most of the time we send these out in GC tuning unless it's a special request. So if you're not sure, you can also look at the top of the page and when highlights and when uh, when she ships them out, she'll highlight which uh, tuning the, the top of the page there, as you can see on this chart. So I've got my electronic tuner up. I need this string to be a C note. We loosen the strings for shipping, so we're going to have to bring it up to pitch. This is registering as an A on this instrument. It could be anything on yours, depending on how much we loosened it and what happens in transit. We're gonna bring it up to C. On the other end of the instrument, I will find the corresponding tuner and start making adjustments. Now I'm on B flat. There's B. Now I'm on a C, but it's a little flat. Hopefully you can see my tuner well enough that I want the needle there in the middle. And also the green light on with no red lights around it. If you go too far, now I'm on C sharp. C with the little number sign beside it. So I need to back it down to a C. There we go. All right, we've got a pretty good C note there. The instrument is shipped with new strings, which tend to stretch out a lot at first and settle in. So you may find that you're tuning a little more often during the first few days of having the instrument. That's normal. One last thing to know about for your low drone string is the drone capo. Down at the other end of the instrument, by where the tuners are, we'll look inside and we'll see this little paddle right here. For this model, that's the drone capo. The way you use it, you rotate it so that it's pointed directly at the string. Our note that was previously a C is now a D. To disengage it, just rotate it back out of the way. I know it's a little hard to see with my hand in the way there. And there we go. 
When using the drone capo, it's either fully disengaged or fully engaged. There's no in-between. In other words, you don't want it kind of at an angle there, cockeyed, just barely touching the string. You'll see you won't get a clean note and it makes weird sounds. So, fully engaged or fully disengaged. Thanks for joining in. That concludes this video.